A new poll out today says that 49 percent of Americans agree with the travel ban, 41 percent oppose. Mark Phillips is watching the reaction of U.S. allies. Not just the crowds that have poured onto the streets of Europe are angry with Donald Trump. Say it now, say it clear. Refugees are welcome here. The disenchantment has now reached the highest levels of European politics. Along with the menace of Vladimir Putin's aggressive Russia and China's military buildup in the South China Sea and militant Islam, Donald Trump's United States has become a threat to Europe, according to Donald Tusk, the president of the European Union's most powerful body. We cannot surrender to those who want to weaken or invalidate the transatlantic bond, without which global order and peace cannot survive. What frightens the EU is President Trump's support for the British to leave, expressed to Prime Minister Theresa May, and for other countries to follow. That and his perceived lack of commitment to NATO, and now the refugee ban. This action is inhumane, it's racist, and it's immoral. His unpopularity is expressed in Parliament. Of this wretched man, picketing man. And a petition calling for the president's planned state visit to be cancelled has clicked up over 1.7 million signatures. Demonstrations, angry words in parliament, petitions, condemnations from foreign leaders, the travel ban has driven yet another wedge between Donald Trump and the European allies. Donald Trump has got to go! And the fear is there's more to come. Mark Phillips, CBS News, London.